Hello and welcome back to No Man's Land. As you can see the snow has arrived January the 1st. It's absolutely freezing so I'm going to head inside and get myself some proper attire to deal with the farm today. In these winter months. So let's go and get a nice hat on. And a jacket. Because I won't survive long out there in just this jumper and jeans. What should we go for? That looks good. But yeah, I hope everybody had a good Christmas. Today's jobs are going to be um, dealing with everything else on the farm. I might do the back field that I said I was going to do. A couple more fields there. Because there is a lot behind me. That I've not took advantage of yet behind the trees that you can make use of so I'll show you all that today let's get a little woolly hat on and some gloves and we'll get out there the crunch of the snow there's not actually much you can do in winter, apart from care for your livestock. I'll still be able to work the trees, but I have filled that uh, that production up now. So I'm just going to take care of the animals. Might go and sell a bit of honey. Just get through these winter months. I think I can plough one of the other fields, get that one ready. I'm just going to nudge this to fill it up. Eventually I will get a fort lift, but for now we'll just gear the nudge. It's not happening, come on. There we go, you just got to tip it up and it'll pour in. That's the chickens fed. I'm going to get a few more chicken coops as well in a later episode. I think it'll be the next one. Because they are good money eggs. And with one of my fields growing wheat, it's just free food for the chickens. Obviously grow your own wheat, put it in the silo to the left store it in there and if I can get about three or four chicken coops we'll be uh, we'll make some good money but I think I'm just going to play about with this episode it's going to be a bit of a um, different one I'm just going to play about one of these plows see what this does I've never actually used one of these before so I'm going to go down to the shop pick this Samaz City 180 plow up and see what kind of fun we can have with this <laughs> Let's see what this looks like. Magic. Hmm. Seems to be leaving a bit behind. I don't know if that's because of the speed I'm going. I mean, feel free to let me know in the comments first time I've used it. Is it the speed I'm going or is it just the plow or is that just how it works? Mind you, I suppose, yeah, in real life when it gets full, would it be stopping to drop that off? Should I be pushing it to the side? I don't know, don't know what I'm doing with this plough. Just trying to pass some winter time. Might be best just pushing it to the side, I reckon. Because that's not... not great. Yeah, no, I've just pushed it in there, haven't I? Just going to be leaving piles all over. Like an Aristotle. What's that there yet? I don't think I'm going to be making any snowmen anyway. Hang on.
What am I doing with my life? Yeah, I think I've had about enough fun with that. It doesn't seem to be doing that much, does it really? Just pushing like white paint around. Let's carry on with the actual work because that's not as fun as I thought it was going to be. I thought I could do a massive pile. I probably can, but yeah. I thought it would be similar to the ones where you're pushing the grain, but that doesn't seem to leave any behind. This does. It seems to be leaving a lot of snow on the floor. Ah, yeah, well. As you can see, I've sold the plough, and as you can also see, the snow melted. So, that was completely pointless. Literally about two hours later, the sun came out, the snow just dwindled away. So I'm going to go to sleep because I want to get through these winter months. I'm going to hibernate like a bear. And I will be back when we can actually do some decent farming. So frosty one this morning. I'm just going over to the timber time to see what how much we've got. As you can see there's still plenty of wood still in storage. 24,000 litres. Just proves how much you can get out of like three or four trees. And as you can see, we've got a fair few amount of pallets. So when they come into decent price, we'll get them shipped off. Currently they are standing at nowhere near really. June, July, I want to be selling them. Not really worth it at the moment. But yeah, it's good to see that production's actually working. Should bring me in some good money. That's good. May seem pointless, but I'm going to sell the this first batch of um, lettuce while the price is quite high. February the 1st. So I'm going to show you my excellent forklifting skills. I'm fully licensed on the game. So simply sit back and enjoy some of the finest forklift work you've ever seen. Just this one pallet to go, I don't know why it's upside down. Way! Told you I was late. Right trick that. Jesus. I don't know what that were, but um, I'm going to go and claim whiplash. I knew I should have worn my Ivy's jacket. Right, let's get this one on and get it down to the shop. I don't know what happened there. Answers on a postcard. Very dangerous, this lettuce game. Just trying to fit it in that gap. And it uh, seems to go crazy on me. Just starting to snow now. Which will be good because it will heal my neck. 
Let's get this last one on, get the honey back on, and finally get this lettuce sold. So we're down to £279. Huh. Not great. Look at that, fits perfect. I tell you. Whew. Just a little shove and it's in. Come on. Come on, that's perfect. Just get it in. Uh, it makes no difference, could have just stacked it on top, couldn't have what Bosh is in. I just want it to look neat, I'm just that kind of person, it's just got to be neat. Little push, look at that. Couldn't be better. Get the honey on, let's get down to the shop. Snow's coming down quite heavy now. Get this sold and I think we'll get back up home. Get a nice warm drink. It does say on the forecast that there is snow, but we'll be going into March soon. And then it'll be back to spring. And we can start doing this fields, getting them fields done behind the farm. Which will be the next one, get them fields done. I'm interested to see how much you get from this. I reckon it might be quite a lot actually. It'd be nice if it were around 10, 15,000, something like that, but it gets me back in the game. Let's get these down and see what we get. Just over 12,000, nearly 13,000 is it? That's um, not bad at all. I'll take that. Definitely going to get a few more greenhouses. On the next episode I'm going to be building more chicken huts, get more greenhouses and we'll start getting this money back. It has been a slow process to start off with. That's what it's like at the beginning of the game because I do start with no money. I take a little bit of a loan, which I didn't want to take. But yeah, it's a slow process building it up, but once you get there... We can start expanding and then it'll just suddenly skyrocket. I'm going to go home now because it's so, it's getting quite heavy the snow. Thanks all for watching. It's been a bit of a weird episode on it. Just starting out with the snow plough. Not actually achieving anything. <laughs> but we've sold us, we've sold us crop. And worry not, the ex next episode will be jam-packed full of stuff. Because we're heading towards spring. See you later. Maybach.